everybody, this is John Bain. I want to welcome you to Scrap Mechanic. Hope you guys are doing pretty good today. I'm doing good myself. Don't forget to mind you all to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you can be here when stuff happens, because here we are. Well, you know, you know the game. I, I got to say it again, because I already said it once. I can say it again, Scrap Mechanic Survival. No, the Scrap Mechanic in Scrap Mechanic Survival. Anyway, we're here today. I'm going to do a couple little bit of things. I do want to say that um, uh, thank you so much for the support of the last video. Uh, it, the, 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 it was insane. The, the cutter was insane. I say it was because I had to disassemble it because it was just sitting there directing FPS. But I did a heck of a lot of testing after afterwards, like directly at the recording. I did a couple things like I made this standing up. Rapid, it automatically wraps around a tree, goes up it, and tries to saw it from the top down. But found out that trees are eight, blo eight logs, or like the big logs are eight blocks high a piece. And some trees are like 15 15 freaking logs tall man somewhere around there and that's a that's a lot of pistons so it was super floppy with the saw blades on it trying to do stuff so that didn't work um did a couple of things i have two uh new machines back at the place that i'm still working on i'll show it to you guys later but today um i really want to get into base building really soon and uh one thing that we didn't do when we went to the warehouse was clean the warehouse like uh the exterior and the the roof i want to check the roof out too we didn't really do a good job and I will note this. Somebody asked the uh, Axolot slash Scrap Mechanic on Twitter if uh, if it's able to unlock, the if we're able to unlock the warehouse. And they said it's not yet implemented on the Twitter uh, as a reply. This was at, directly from Scrap Me at Scrap Mechanic. So there is really no way to unlock the building, so no one really has a clue. <laughs> we can all assume what it's supposed to be, but there is no way unless you there's some way you're going to go in and cheat or something like that, which I don't know how. I don't care. We're playing it legit. Um, I don't, I don't, I don't, there's no way. There's no way, like, we're going to be able to go up in there and unlock it. So that means all this cool stuff in there, we can't unlock it and grab it. But it looks like, oh, that's off. We can't drive like that. That's not safe. Also, they've uh, put had, like, two patches where they actually put the patch notes, which is a thumbs up to, uh, oh, my God. No, stop going. What, you're automatically going backwards now? Oh, my God. Thumbs up to Axolot for that, too, because that, 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 that's nice. That's nice to ha not just have the patches fixing things, but also have patch notes letting us know what things were being fixed and whatnot, so people can be, like, looking for it and maybe even reporting it back. Anyway, we're going over to the warehouse. We're going to grab us some stuff because I want to go through and look at it and um, make it some choices here. Also, I'm probably very soon, if you're into the tutorial stuff, I'm going to try. I'm going to throw up a tutorial video really soon. Um on a couple things so um anyway that's it we're getting over here we'll be we'll, we'll get to the warehouse we'll be right back all right we're here and there's some things i definitely want right at the bat i want you i want you i want you and i want you and you and you and we want you and you and then you too and then this this is something we can already make but not that that's something else we want we already have the ability to make these but i want you anyway and then oh what's this an angled piece are you serious i want these and i want you and we've already grabbed one of you before i think and i'm gonna grab you and all we're, everything if it's if it's we're, we're not even gonna leave the kitchen sink if there's a kitchen sink we're, we're, we're on it look at this look at all this look at this beautifulness what is this it's in my pocket now that's what it is all right and oh hello you so much stuff to be grabbing and the cool thing is we pretty much have the whole thing opened up and ready to go on the inside oh there's some wiring beautifulness my inventory's full not much longer that's why these are on the side right now watch i'll get shot by a tape bot while i'm standing here looting or disposing of loot and those of you wondering how i'm transferring stuff so quickly first off you can hold shift and left click to move a whole stack you can hold uh shift right click to move one and you can hold shift and middle click to move half a stack I have a macro from playing uh, Ark Survival Evolved, where um, it, I can, oh, there's a light in there. Ark Survival Evolved, where you I used to feed like 20 meat at one time really quickly to a dino, and um, it's it's tied into my mouse, and so I hold Shift and then hit that thing, and I can move my mouse and it swipe, and it ends up clearing out most like a nice line of in, of inventory space, which is a nice saver. I want these curbs. Can I get the curbs? I'm not allowed to grab the curbs. How about with these pipes? Can I have these pipes? No. Okay, I want the pipes to get. Come on, man, work with me here. <laughs> uh, let's put these inside of here. There we go. All right, let's see what else we have for our... Oh, yeah, I wanted these guys, too. I wonder if they stack. Yeah, there's a guy right there. Sorry, I'm so used to, like... I don't know, I play Fallout some, and I'm so used to, like... Ooh, is that a piece? Oh, that's a separate piece. Are they stacking? Um... No. God dang it. Why does nothing stack? 
Oh, there's a chest though. We'll take that. Um, if it's seeds now that I don't need, like if it's any of the basic food groups or even second tier, I just drop it now. Um, this stuff does respawn over time. Um, it's gotta be, oh, shoot, shoot. All right, peace out to you. And I wish we could get the other bots' heads. Like, I wish I could have that tape bot head. That is awesome. I'd love to mount it in on my mantle above the fireplace. That wasn't a spoiler. Oh, crap! That would have spoiled us. All right, uh, anything else around here? No, I heard a moo. Moo, moo, a moo, moo. Uh, nothing around here. Oh, crap! Ha ha, you missed! Woo! Not that time. Yeah, I'm not really caring about aiming too well or, or avoiding things, if you can tell right now. I'm just, I'm, we're here to loot. <gasps> I didn't know it was the bottoms of these. Is it all one piece? Is it all one piece? It is! Oh, those are really nice. I like that. I like that a lot, actually. Those are pretty smexy. Come here, get in my pocket. Oh my god. I gotta fill up my pockets really fast. I need to make more chests. This has just been insane. Uh, I don't know, it's whatever, get in, the, get in the hole. Just everybody get, the, actually we should keep those on us. Uh, hmm, is there anything else around here? I want that pipe, can I have that pipe? I'd love to have these pipes, that'd be amazing. Or unwrap them and then have the big pipes, that'd be really nice. I mean, insulated pipes are good to have. Those are more being delivered and has a little bit of protective coating on it. I'm gonna, I'll grab, come back and grab those pieces. So hoping that there's more variances of stuff here. There's more of the boots, okay. But nothing different other than that. And I've already cleared up here, right? There's nothing else there. I wonder what this is supposed to do. It looks like it's supposed to like shoot us up or something or be a ramp or something, I don't know. But there's a cone. Do we need cones or anything? Are we doing any work anywhere? Uh, I use those for teeth in my dragon that I built one time. Um, I'll hold off on them. I know where they're at. I'm trying. Oh, how about these? Oh, are those the same thing? Oh, no, those are different. Oh, boy. Those are 90 degree versions of these. Are you serious? Oh, that's a happy day for me. Yeah, get in my pocket. Do you stacked? They do stack. Metallic tube bend. Interesting. They stack too. This is this is happy days. Wait, what's the stats on you? It is different as high durability, medium weight, decent friction. Actually, I like that and buoyancy. Oh crap! Where's it at? Oh, it's right there. I'm dead. Ah, but he's dead too. Sorry, I was getting excited about loot. My bad. I'm I'm fired. Right, right. God dang it, Job Bay. What are you doing? You're supposed to be better. I I typically am sometimes, mostly ish. So that in there. Let's get this up here. Okay. And let me grab whatever you drop. Is it a battery or components? Okay, nice. I'll we'll almost take some components. Uh I'm gonna clear out the, all these railings I see like this, because this is this is this is the money right here, man. And I don't have to sit here and wait for these things to craft either. Mine, mine, all mine. Alright, give me a second. Alright, we're back at the uh the 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 work place station slash semi base slash work area testing area testing grounds um and i decided that if i'm gonna go up to the roof um I, i'm gonna go ahead and make some explosives and bring them with me so takes gas poop and uh paint ammo which i guess we're painting the can or something or we're putting it inside the paint ammo can or something i don't know anyway so i'm gonna whoa you're supposed to be done i was oh man did you <laughs> you probably used up all my mats all right that's fine we need one more other than you let's put you over here in there there we go let's craft you up all right that's two of those by the way uh, i forgot to show you guys when we did the did the warehouse i got a really crappy um chest piece this is uh you can't really let me see if i can set up a little bit but there you can see me this is what i got i got like a lumberjack shirt like for for the epic gold i got a lumberjack shirt <laughs> <laughs> I like rocking this out pretty much. I like that. Um, these are different pants, but the shirt here 
Yeah, I posted a thing in the community tab. You were playing the game wrong. Um, you know, <laughs> stop doing it. Um, anyway, that, that I thought that was a nice shirt. And then the pants. We've actually been getting a decent amount of clothes because we've been grinding mats. That's how you get mats in the game. And sometimes these glowy things drop. I did get some horrible golfing shoes, by the way. But I like my boots a lot. I like the pants we got. The shirt's okay. And the gloves seem to match. So that's what we've got. Anyway, I figured I'd show you that real quick. Uh, because that's what's happening. <laughs> Anyway, I'm not gonna. I, I can't spoil what we're working on for the other stuff. That's just the. That's that's part of it. Uh, yep. Yeah. But anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and get back over there. Um, there's a way to use chairs, the seats to get up to the top of the warehouse build. Well, almost to the top, and there's like an indent area, and then there's absolutely nothing there except some like you know structural pipes and stuff like that. Um, so we're just gonna go ahead. I'm gonna run through the the whole uh warehouse, get to the roof, and we'll see what we can grab. And we're gonna try out something else with these explosives. So you guys hold on. I figured on the way up here we can stop in this room and press some buttons. Yeah, that's that's the deal. If you guys are wondering. Again, they said that the, this is not complete. They're still working on it. We can't disassemble. So those I appreciate those that had tried to call it out and let me know. But yeah, um, not connected to anything. So <laughs> it's a visual thing. Oh, also, uh, stuff I cut, I, I was, I recorded most of the time I was in here and I cut a lot of it. Um, there are parts where there are hidden chests and hallways, um, behind walls and stuff. And the only way into them is like some vents and stuff like that. Like in a space like this, I don't think it's a here specifically. No, it's not, but at least, uh, let me see here. We'll do some, we'll go from here and then we can do this and then we can go up. Actually, we'll just get on you. And like in places, oops, well, there we go. In places like that, there's often like stuff hiding, it looks like. So I think once we deactivate the place, like we'll be able to go into some of these hidden areas for different things. I'm, I'm hoping, I don't know. I like, like there's a little bit more to it than just that. And I'm hoping there's ends up being boss fights and stuff like that as well. Kind of to make it more stuff oriented. Uh, it's right over here. So anyway, uh, oh, I'm going to go to another spot, which is it right here? Was it over here? Or is this just... Oh, yeah, I gotta, I gotta be more running to you. Hold on a second. All right. I'm sorry about this, but I just recorded something that... I, well, I didn't record something that I thought I recorded. Like, that's never happened to me ever really before. Actually, it kind of has the night. I've been pretty... Usually pretty stellar about not doing stuff like that. So, we, I came into here. And we're re-recording so I can at least share with you guys what we the knowledge we have received and found out. So I want to check out these rooms again, and um, well, as you guys noticed, we can put we can put explosives or things on our lift. So I pop down my lift, put down explosive, and check this wall, and this is in here. And it looks like it's like a like a lock or a timer or something. Um, I'm guessing that it's an encryption thing. And there's this down but down below it, and there's nothing you can do about it. Again. Um, I'm guessing that this is encased type stone that is non-destructible that they use to surround uh, an area to where you can't, you know, like, like, like if you want to encase it so you can't get out or break through, there you have it. There it is. So there's this one. And then also in this room, uh, we have another one, which I accidentally blew out the floor. As you can see, it didn't blow out anything other than that. Let's put this down here. So don't, and this one's a different color. And it looks like a lock as well with these bars and the electrical things going uh, upside down and right side up on it. So it looks like it's got little handles there so we can maybe pull it out or something. I don't know. Those are in here. So like, and up here you can see the different rooms are lit up with this. And then we had a third bomb and I wanted to try that wall. Remember that pesky wall from the warehouse episode? I was like, this looks like this should lead to something. Well, I blew it up. I really want to be able to grab you so bad. And it just leads into back into the utility hallway <laughs> that leads to the elevator that leads to up, up to the roof where we're headed to anyway so that's what this area has so um you know for those of you wondering there's two different i think those are the encryptors or whatever they are up here and then yeah this so there we go we got some information um on that and i really wish that again that the uh there's no respawns here like once you beat it it looks like it's just done so they don't come back. You don't get to fight tape pots anymore and things like that. So let's go to the roof. Come on, roof. Let's go. Uh, 
It sucks to have to blow up that hallway that we did, but you know, science. There's casualties with science, and it's for the better of men of all. And it is nighttime, almost daytime. Okay, okay. So I have those blocks already. What blocks do we have hanging out here? Is there any blocks we're missing? Hmm. I want to see if there's anything that I can get that I haven't gotten here before. Can I get? No, that's part of this. Out of order. And if you guys are wondering about anything with the top here, this is just the same one. We've since we already unlocked the warehouse, this would have been locked, but we've already unlocked it. So it doesn't really matter bottom floor or top floor. And I guess if you want to skip and get to the goodies at a place and you have a flyer or you want to use the chair method to get up top, you could. But that kind of kills the fun for me. So it's the same looking stuff here so far. Nothing here I can grab. So I want to double check. Can't take anything like this from here. It's all part of it. We checked this last time. Nothing here. Okay. Yeah, oh, I grabbed that last time. I remember that. Yeah, that piece. The one singular piece. Nothing. No entrances to any of these containers. Okay. It's all clear. Clear. Okay, clear. Uh, how about these things? I never checked them. Can I, please let me take them at least. <gasps> you can. Oh, crap. We found pieces. Nice. Oh, that's nice. Oh, those we could put those like, those would look like spinny thingies that we don't want to talk about. They look like, oh, what is that on the inside? Oh, we got, we're taking them all. It's all mine. It's mine. Not your L item. Oh, no. Oh, wow. Weight generator coil segment. A decent amount of friction on that thing, too. Hmm. That's pretty chewy. Here we can do that. And grab another one. How about this? What's this called? Uh, oh, it's just the tower pole painted. Nice. Oh, those are the bigger pipes and a connection point for the said pipes. Okay. Um, I didn't park right below this, but I'm gonna jump down and then I'm gonna. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Is there anything else that we can take? Can we take apart this then? <gasps> And there's rails of those are the standard ones we already have. There's the dishes though. We can grab the dishes. Hmm. Is there anything else? Just before 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 we say, hey, I'm gonna go ahead and grab this. Can I grab these? <gasps> I can grab those in here too. Oh, and there's that. Oh, oh my god. Okay. 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 Um Man, oh man, oh man, since I don't need spuds. Okay, I know what I'm going to do. I don't want to make a cheaty fire and come up here. Yep, let me go ahead and handle my, my business, my business, and we'll be right back. Okay, I have done a test for science. A willing sacrifice for you guys to see something. So there's concrete up here. I took the concrete, made me a little ramp. Went to the edge, dropped my entire inventory down below. My, and you can see it down there, actually. Okay, so it did work. So I, if you want to loot up here, oops, I'm doing the wrong way. You can do this. Just make sure you have enough space down below. I think I have enough room for one more full inventory, so we'll just do this. But that's what I'm doing. And this is how I'm getting all my stuff down below without having to keep running up and down, up and down, up and down. Hopefully it doesn't despawn. <laughs> we need to hurry up, actually. That's that's what that's what that's telling me right now. All right. Um, I didn't grab the tower because I'm not gonna. I don't. I have a, a, a probably a soon use for the ramps. Um, and the tower itself, I I don't know, but I'm gonna disassemble this generator because it's just too cool anyway. But like, uh, I, I'll come back up for the tower at another time. Get up here. There we go. There we, there we get up here. There we go. Yeah, these these pieces look really cool. You, the the posing side here is pretty neat for like if you want to do some designs and stuff like like that'd be really neat. Uh, guess we can go and just grab these then. Watch, I'll end up wishing I had grabbed everything, which I already kind of do, but we have to draw the line somewhere, right? Yeah, we're full. Okay, let's go. All right, we're gonna try this out. It's almost nighttime, so it's gonna be nighttime fall time. Uh, and my car is right there as you can see the little the dots for the connection points So let's do this. Let's go over here. 
And ho uh, I might not be far enough out to get to it. We'll try. Yeah, we might. Or we won't. Or did I spam it fast enough? It doesn't matter. And it's all here. Yes! Uh, crunch time. Uh, actually, we have. I moved this box that was in front of the door over to there. Uh, let me just fill it up with stuff then. It's crunch time. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. All right, cool. Let's go over here, grab everything we can. Did some stuff despawn? Or did it just get caught up? It just got caught up there. Okay, great, 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 great. And we're going to throw it all out here. So there you go. So uh, that's the thing until they, if they decide to fix that, that sucks. Because it's already kind of a pain to get up there anyway. And we can't get anything else from the warehouse. So I'd like to get everything we can. Um, and we got a couple more things on our inventory here. Let's throw that up there too. Okay, whatever. Oh yeah. So it was a success. It was a resounding success. Then I get shot by a tape bot. Oh yeah. All right. Uh, let's go up here. There we go. And then grab these ones. Oh wow. All the treasures just waiting to get built. Ah, oh, full inventory. Please tell me we got enough room. Wait, do I have some room in here? I don't. Uh, do I have any room in here? I do. Beautiful. Get in there. All right, we just filled that one. Do you have room? No. Do you have room? Yes. Yes, you have plenty. That's perfect. Uh, the, the What makes this so awesome is these are pieces we can't make in the game. Like, I mean, like, we, we can't craft them. We can't craft them. So this this is total win right here. For This is this is it. So if I want to come and clear off the rest of that top, I'm going to probably need several more ch large chests attached to this. Interactive chests, whatever you want to call it. Um, I'm calling them large chests right now. And yeah, so that's, we got spoils of war. Is that Ruby? No, it's not Ruby timing. Good stuff. All right, well, it's nighttime. I'm gonna head back to, uh, we'll go back to the, the testing ground slash workshop area and and go and, and look at some of the stuff and see what, what the deal is. And I'm just excited. I can barely talk right now. We got new building pieces. I'm excited. All right, you guys hold on. Ow. Ooh. Okay, welcome back. And uh, well, we got our spoils of victory together here. Uh, I think tonight, today, tonight, whatever was a big win. And what do we have in front of us? Well, we got a light. We have a steel angle bracket, I think it's called. Then we got the little elbow for the, the bigger pipes, which is nice. And we have a bigger, bigger pipe elbow. And then these generators look awesome. Really cool. Cool looking stuff. We could do some great decorative stuff with that, I think. Um, and like the stats on some of these, the, the weight and durability is pretty solid. Um, and the same, well, the, and these guys look pretty cool too. We also got these two pieces, which this is an odd size one. It's three blocks wide by three blocks wide. So we can center stuff off of it to do some neat stuff. We got these pipes too. Uh, what else do we do? Uh, oh, oh, I want to check out the painting. We'll use the nice bright blue, shall we? Nice. Okay. Nice. Ooh, that's pretty. What does that do? Just the outside of it. So the only the exterior gets done. Is that the same here? That is the same here. Okay, how about you? Okay, just that. And I guess this one gets done. Nice. We still have that. Obviously, we know how these look. Okay, okay. That's not too bad. Hmm. Hmm. And we got a decent amount of stuff. The spoils. Uh, these are all the big ramp pieces, which we needed to pull out a couple of these, too, to look at. Oh, my God. I can't believe I didn't. I wasn't going to do it. I'm sorry. I apologize right now. Sorry. If you were yelling, this is, this, I don't blame you. I would be, too. Look at that. Okay, so this orange is natural color, obviously. And then we have the corner side pieces, too. Now, I'm pretty certain that the orange is the only thing that changes. And it still looks super duper cool. What are the stats on these? Um, oh, wow. They have a decent friction. They're heavy as hail, though. But, man, I wish they were lighter. That'd be really nice if they were. Are these guys lighter? No. We need to do some testing, too. On <laughs> I love doing testing. If it's just a base off that weight stat or if the weight stat plus the size of the block. That's something I need to know. I need to find out, too, um, how that works out. Oh, I like the bolts on the back of that. Uh, we also got some diamond plating, too. I don't. It's buried in here with other stuff. Um, a lot of all this other stuff we've already. Oh, we didn't look at that one, did we? Is that the piece that goes on top of you? Oh, neat. Oh, that's where we got that piece. Is part of that, that system. Okay, so there there's a, a nice amount of that too. What is your stats? Okay, so high weight, it's actually just that's pure to me 
decorative kind of level. Um, the durability is lower than the weight, so that that add, means like decoration, or if we need to add some, you know, well, decorating heaviness to it. No, nope. come on, there you go. Yeah, that looks pretty cool, and actually, the that gold with the the blue looks all right too. Huh? Interesting. Um, neat, 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 neat. Was there any? Oh, uh, I wanted to see how. Well, we already saw how those connected. Is there anything? Oh, oh, and this thing here too. Look at this. The weight's actually decently low on on these tower poles. Uh, I'm surprised. Low friction though, but durability. Once we we do some testing with weight, we can see how how well it's going going to or not to work. Because uh, it'd be interesting to use that into like actual vehicle builds. If they're if they're that if they actually are. If it ends up being one piece is an overall weight, I really don't think it is. I'm, I'm going to guess that, that there's a, a multiplier based on the size of the block area that it takes on top of the weight stat itself. But if it doesn't for some weird reason, because, you know, games are weird, um, we might end up using that for stuff. If anything, for like like vehicles, if anything, we'll use it for base stuff because that would be really need to have some like interior stuff decorated with this with like a corner piece on there. Um and oh my god, I am so happy about these. That is so nice. And it's got decent friction. Oh boy. Oh boy, that's what we got. Oh, I guess since we're here, I could show you this. This is the latest test of what I've been working on. Yes. There you go. Here you go. Freebie here. For you guys standing stay until the end of the episode, there you go. You might be wondering, John Bain, John Bain, why do you have cactuses on your grabbers? Well, let me show you. I was looking, this is why I've been so interested in stats lately too, is I was looking for something, I was like, the one of, I try to troubleshoot my problems um, individually. Like, I don't care about, you know, like engines and stuff right now because it doesn't really mess with like the overall physics of what I'm trying to do. What I am worried about is trying to make the different systems I'm coming up with work most, the best way possible. This is mainly testing the grabber, but those cactuses, if you look, I'm looking for weight versus friction. And the best part, the best one that has the best ratio of it is a dang cactus, pot of cactus, low weight, super high friction um and that it has so i'm using it to grab things better i guess i could show you right quick if oh i remove my I, I can't right now it's 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 put away we'll save that for another time but you can see some of the stuff that there i i've i have been doing a lot of tree cutting testing like after the last episode and up until this one um and then we're going to be doing a, a, a tutorial soon for the, the 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 basic irrigation system and stuff like that so but that 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 i just figured I'd show you that and then we have another type of build coming together uh, over there, and just stuff's just happening everywhere. My God. And you know what the best part of the day was? Getting to hang out with you guys, and I really appreciate y'all checking out the video. It really means a lot to me. Um, that is the time we got for today. We'll be, be back again with more Scrap Mechanics survival content. Um, don't forget, if you guys want to come hang out, we got the Discord up. There's a lot of people, cool people hanging out in there just chatting and chilling and stuff like that. It's been really good so far. It's been, you guys have been amazing. So thank you so much. And well, I guess as always, thank you so very much. And you all have a great night.